I'm meal prepping for the week. channel my name is Janet Domehina hello if you're new here I make fitness content lifestyle content and everything in between and I hope you subscribe so in today's video what we are meal prepping we are meal prepping for the week I am super excited about this meal prep primarily because we were out of town this weekend we went to my best friend Heather's wedding I was in the wedding I was a bridesmaid. This is my first time being a bridesmaid and it was so much fun. And with weekends like that, I always look forward to coming back and like getting my life together, okay? I always look forward to it. So I was super inspired once we got in town today. I went grocery shopping and I'm about to make some soup for dinner, meal prepping some soup for the week for dinner. And then I'm making Michael and I some lunch for the week. So the soup is gonna be vegetable soup. And then for lunch, it's gonna be like a chicken rice veggie medley combo. I got these meal prep containers from H-E-B. I was super excited, they were only like $10 and it comes in a pack of like 25. I'm gonna link something similar down below for you guys if you're wanting some meal prep containers. Um, these are disposable so I can just throw them out at work once I use them. So yeah. On days where I was super tired and hot and just flustered from a long day at work. All I wanted was some comfort food. So I was going out to eat after work and I just was not being, I wasn't being bad. Like I was getting like a salad or like, you know, salad and fries on the side and stuff like that. But like, I wasn't being as good as I could have been. So now I'm going to be meal prepping a whole bunch of meals for this week, especially for when I get off of work. There needs to be something here for me to eat so I'm not tempted to go to Chick-fil-A. Because you know, we all are tired after work sometimes. Like, sometimes you just don't feel like cooking after work. Sometimes you just want something that's convenient. And if you have food at home, that equals conveniency, right? Right? Okay. <laughs> all right, okay. Let's get to prepping this soup. I found a random recipe on Google. That's how I usually like find recipes. That's how I find things to make. I just find random recipes and I just make them my own basically. So I found this recipe from Natasha's Kitchen. It's just a vegetable soup recipe. Nothing crazy. So let's start with that. So I am chopping up an onion right now. All right guys, so I've cut up an onion, a carrot, and some green bell pepper. I'm about to saute this real quick. I already put in the onions, the bell pepper, and the carrots to kind of saute for about eight minutes. So I'm gonna kind of like walk you through what I'm doing next. So in the next six to eight minutes, I'm gonna be putting in the tomatoes, diced tomatoes, green beans. I'm gonna be putting in some of this vegetable broth that I got from H-E-B, as well as seasonings and some potatoes. I'm gonna throw some potatoes in there as well. So let me cut up those potatoes and by the time I finish cutting them up, it'll be time to put them in there. So let's do it. So this has been sauteing for about six to eight minutes. Pretty soft now. So we're gonna pour in the diced tomatoes. Okay. Put in some of the green beans. Some vegetable broth is gonna go This is a pretty much filled to the brim. It's gonna obviously reduce. I'm just gonna go ahead and throw some seasonings in. Thank you. 
While the soup simmers for about 30 minutes, I'm gonna go ahead and get prepped on the other half of the meal prep for the week, which is the chicken dinner, chicken and rice dinners. So I'm gonna clean this chicken and then I'm gonna cut it up and put some seasonings on it and let it sit for a good 30 minutes. And then we're gonna cook it and all that good stuff. So let's go ahead and prep the chicken right now. While the chicken is cooking, I know y'all can hear that, I am going to be prepping my rice. I know, I could make rice from scratch, but these are just so much easier. These are the Ben's Original Ready Rice. I use these all the time, they're a quick fix, and yeah, I love the brown basmati rice. I've taken out the chicken and I've put it on this paper towel and plate for it to just kind of like sit. I put the rice in that pan. I'm gonna be putting a little bit of coconut aminos on the rice. It's just a great alternative to soy sauce. These are the coconut aminos that I use. I'm gonna be putting these in the rice. <laughs> Just seasoned and oiled the broccoli. I'm gonna be putting it in the oven for about 10 minutes. I've decided I do not wanna put the corn in the vegetable soup. However, I do have green onions, and I love green onions, so I'm gonna throw these in and then let it cook for about 10 more minutes, and then I'm pretty sure the soup's just gonna be ready to go. Amazing, I'm just gonna add a little bit more vegetable broth just to make it a little bit more soupy. I have my meal prep containers right here. I'm gonna rinse them out, wash them, actually, not rinse them out. I'm gonna wash these before I use them. Make sure if you purchase meal prep containers or any containers, wash before you use them. So, we're gonna wash these right now. Mila. So, we have our chicken, or what, what? what's wrong with me? We have our rice broccoli and chicken. I'm going to plate these in the bowls. I have them right here. So rice, or chicken, broccoli, rice, all going in the bowl. Alright guys, so this is what the meal prep comes out to look like. Some of them could use more chicken, but it's fine. Probably should have purchased more chicken, but I know for next time that I would probably need like a bigger batch of chicken for this meal prep. But yeah, this is what it looks like. I'm super excited. Or I like to eat my rice bowls with sriracha, so I'm probably gonna doze this in sriracha. I'm gonna let this sit and cool before putting them in the fridge. Let's go check on the soup because the soup should almost be done by now. Actually, the soup is done. Yeah.
So good. I'm definitely gonna be making this soup like all winter long, all winter and fall long. And you can put rice on top of this soup, it'll be bomb. You can just put it over some potatoes, super bomb. I put potatoes in the soup, so you know, you can like, you have your carbs in here as well. And the potatoes soak up all the flavor, so good. I could have made it with chicken, but I just wanted it to just be a regular like vegetable soup. If you wanna throw in chicken later in the week, you can do that. But I think it's just best to keep it like a vegetable soup. But I feel like this meal prep right here is no more than like $30, 30 to $40. But yeah guys, that is my mini meal prep for the week. I am probably gonna do this all over again on Wednesday because I'm gonna be home on Wednesday. So I'm probably gonna do this all over again for Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. I'm gonna make a bigger batch so it can last us a little bit longer. And yeah, trying to be healthy, okay? Trying to reach these goals. I'm gonna go ahead and plate this right now. Probably need, we're gonna need like a bigger like pot to make a big batch of it. All right guys, this was so much fun. I loved doing this with you guys. Leave some recipes down below that you think that I should try for the next meal prep video. I wanna do these often because I'm really trying not to eat out as much and trying to reach my weight loss goals for the month. So yeah, let me know if you try it. Let me know if you love it. And yeah guys, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out Girl Scout. No one can do it like you. Ooh.